Thanks, Matt. Well, both Ted Cruz and Donald Trump have made statements on their view of Muslims. While Trump has said he would like to ban Muslim immigration to the United States, Cruz said he would like to secure and patrol American Muslim communities stateside. All of that talk has groups in Northeast Wisconsin starting a dialogue with non-Muslims. NBC26's Eric Kress joins us live at 6 with how a local organization is starting the conversation. Misconceptions about the Muslim faith run wild, with recent violence sometimes being associated with the religion. But a local group is trying to change that one conversation at a time. The Crest Family Branch Library in De Pere is a place to get educated and broaden horizons. No better place to learn about a religion that sometimes gets a bad rap because of some sects of the Muslim faith that misinterpret it. I mean, I know there's a mosque in Green Bay, and, um, but I would say that most people probably don't have much interaction with Muslim people. The climate that we live in, um, there's a lot of fear about Islam, a lot of um, misnomers and stereotypes about Islam. Dozens showed up to ask questions and of course to hear about what the faith is truly about. And this just happens to be an opportunity to engage the public and set the record straight that Islam is a peaceful religion. And there's a difference between the religion and the extremists and the terrorists. Because while we're bombarded by international news of terrorists and suicidal bombers who claim to be Muslims. We are all in this together. Every person on this planet is in this together. Today a message is being shared in Northeast Wisconsin, a message of faith and how someone who claims to have it would never turn to violence. The Ahmadiyya Muslim Youth Association plans on having more local discussions about what Islam faith is really about in the near future. We've included a link to their website where you can find out more on NBC26.com. Keeping you connected, I'm Eric Crest, NBC26.